Hi everyone, today we're eating at Frontera Cocina, which is a restaurant from a famous chef called Rick Bayless, and he was actually on Top Chef. He won the Master of Chef. So it's really cool to go to like a fancy, well-known restaurant to your restaurant. <laughs> and yeah, it's located in Disney Springs, and it has a nice outside door uh, patio area, and um, it serves obviously Mexican food. And so um, here's the menu. The guacamole and chips verde is vegan. I'm sure you get the verde. And for um, a meal, I got myself some tacos. And they have these garlicky mushrooms and eggplant tacos that come, obviously say no goat cheese. Make, say that you want to make it vegan and they'll do that for you. And it comes with refried beans and a side of um, guacamole. And uh, I also wanted to point out that as a side, you can also get the arroz con platanos with plantains. So that's also vegan. And for my drink, I actually got this delicious uh, drink that I wanted to point out because it was so good. It's La Bandera. No, scroll down. Thank you. And uh, it had tequila and prickly pear juice. It has the lime foam, and I asked, and they said that there's no egg white on it, because usually foams have egg whites, but it was totally vegan. So that's what I ate, and let me show you now. This is my conservative, conservative uh, Disney look. <laughs> Anyways, let me show you here, actually, because it's so dark in that room. But yeah, so these are my cute um, coach ears. So they're like, you see, they have like the coach flowers that sometimes they do in their bags and it's all leather and it's beautiful never worn it before and my little these are from Swarovski and yeah so very uh woman in black Mickey in black and we're gonna um we're gonna go to Disney Springs and have um dinner with a really really good friend from college that lives here and her girlfriend so so excited and I forgot to show you the bag that I wore today, which still matches now, because it's, you know, attitude. <laughs> so this is a, a coach collection that uh, they did with this thing. And I love this one, because it's just like, it's just grumpy, Mickey. <laughs> so cute. So, still goes for the outfit, so. And then I'm just gonna wear uh, my black sneakers, because we're still gonna walk around downtown Disney. Disney Springs, whatever. If you know, if you still call it downtown Disney, we could be friends. <laughs> so, yeah, gotta go have fun. So, we're eating at Frontera Cocina, which is a restaurant in uh, Disney Springs. I, I always call it downtown Disney, but it's Disney Springs. And I'm here with, you guys wanna be in camera? Are you okay being in camera? I'm here with my really good friend. This is my friend Camilla from college and her beautiful girlfriend Kathy that I love so much and oh, I love you. so uh, yeah this is uh the vegan guacamole because they have different guacamoles but the verde is guacamole uh, is vegan so that's what I'm having for um, appetizer and a prickly pear tequila I love you guys so here are the entrees of everybody and this is the vegan version so it has mushrooms and cauliflower i believe yeah no no sorry eggplant eggplant and mushrooms it comes with a side of guacamole these are vegan um beans as you can tell these are not vegan beans so they're a little different. They're more like refried beans, I guess. And then you eat them with the um, little side of the um, tortillas. Thank you, Kathy. <laughs> awesome. Delicious. It's like taco. I'm going to give it a try. Uh, let's see. Got to have a little bit of the, uh, of the, um, the eggplant and the guacamole and the um, beans. So let's see. Oh my god! Too spicy? Like some pepper. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! 
Yeah, that's why I had the chip. Well, my review is that I can't taste anything because my dead taste buds are dead. Kathy, <laughs> <laughs> like my joke. <laughs> oh, literally. Oh my gosh. That was way too spicy for me. So I just asked for, I can't eat, I can't, I cannot eat this. And I don't feel bad asking for another because I literally cannot put it in my mouth. That's what she said. Yes, I know. But then, what did I say? Oh yeah, then I'm like, can I just have something like not spicy at all whatsoever? And then... I said you're gonna get extra flavor on that one. This is not as funny now. It's not as funny now. For the moment. It's a comedian thing. Thank you, thank you. I'm so sad. You have to record your entire life. Yes. Okay, let's do, what was I called? that movie? What's it, uh, with Jim Carrey? No, no, we're the we're, mask. no, no, the one with, no, the one where they record his life. That just oh, like the Truman Show. Show. That's what I need. I need the Truman Show. Anybody? And I got a new one made. They are amazing here. So this one has no peppers and no spice. Thank the maker. So wait, you? Oh. No, I can taste things. I can taste food. Oh my gosh. Hey guys, so we're walking out of Disney Springs, all dressed up in Christmas for the holidays. It's really beautiful here. I guess you come check it out at night because it's such a like beautiful atmosphere. But um, had an amazing time at a dinner especially just because we were there with friends that I haven't seen in a long time and they were amazing letting me <laughs> do my vlogs and stuff but my friend watches that so she knows what I do <laughs> but um overall I had an amazing time um the drinks that I had I liked my drink a lot I had two of them it was a prickly pear tequila drink and I usually don't like tequila but I didn't taste tequila it's a little bit sweet but it was good the guacamole was delicious. It was really fresh. The chips I didn't love so much. I mean, they were, they tasted like a, I don't know, store-bought chips. But the guacamole was delicious. And then the fact that they remade my dish again so that I could eat it was amazing. I honestly, like, when I put it in my mouth, like, fire could have come out. It was so spicy. And so, I mean, that was my mistake. I was just like so, I usually, when I go eat Mexican, I think, and I tell them like no spice, I just didn't think about it. So that was really gracious of them to make it again. I thought it was a small amount of food for the price that you got, but it was really well cooked. I could taste the eggplant and the mushrooms. The beans were okay. I don't love refried beans as much. I liked the other beans that Anthony had, but I can't have those because those are pork. But it, it was nice that they gave you a sort of guacamole and the tortillas were nice so overall it was a very very nice experience uh, and again nice atmosphere the waiter was so gracious and nice so i would recommend it especially when you're going out for for drinks and with friends i would mostly probably if i went back again i would go more for drinks and appetizers uh instead of the um i don't know if i would order that again the uh enchilada the, the, the tacos but I really liked, like I said, the drinks of the atmosphere. Maybe it had to do with the fact that I was with Amazing Company, but yeah, that's pretty much my review of the what Frontera Casino. What? You were company. You're part of the company. Why aren't you there? But I'm normally part of the company. You don't say those kinds of things. Because the food is good, so I don't have to, I don't have to say anything else to make it better. I mean, this food was good, but I think it was even greater because of the company. Your company's always great. <laughs> um, but yeah, I, honestly, actually, that's a good point because the food that we had before this one has been better. So, um, but yeah, I mean, this one is, you don't have to go into the parks. This is in Disney Springs. 
so anybody can come here you know so anyways that's my little review anything to add you like your dish right yeah. yeah exactly it's good it's not like the best thing i've ever had it's good so there you go bye guys so here are some pictures of the meal this was the pre non-spicy version <laughs> um but overall like i said it was it was beautiful atmosphere and good food definitely good food um, and thank you so much camilla and kathy for coming and and uh spending time with us and for sure next time we will hit orlando um they came to disney they're, they're not disney disney fans but they came for just to have time with us so i love you so much and this is uh disney springs the uh, the world of disney look how beautiful the decorations were we just had a beautiful time and um yeah so thanks for watching as always i'm hoping that you're enjoying these daily videos and aloha guys